Hey everyone, Sean is here. Welcome back. So in this video, I'm going to set up the second and most important ad of this whole system. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up the ad based on the lookalike audience. All right, so this is a really, really important ad that you need to set up to get the whole cycle. If you remember, I talked about it really good. All right, so let me show you how you can do that and it's really easy you just have to change a couple of small stuff all right so let's go into it so the first thing you need to do is you need to go to the campaign that you just created and what you're going to do is you basically are going to copy um, this whole thing now if you see this this is the ad set that we created and it has the ad that we just set up if you let me just go inside take a look this is the ad that we just set up in the last video so what you're gonna do is you wanna click on this uh, edit button here and you click on create similar ad set. Now let me explain uh, while this thing is loading, let me explain how this uh, how this works. Um, Facebook has a, a has this ad system that ha the, the, the first thing is campaign and under each campaign there are ad sets and under each ad set there are multiple ads. Okay, so each ad um, uh, is under each ad set. Now, ad sets, uh, ad sets ha have multiple ads under them, and ad set is the place where you set up your audience. Okay, so you can define a specific audience and show multiple ads to one audience to see which one works better. You know, this is these are all for um, testing purposes, obviously. So, um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna copy the same ad set. And just change ad and the audience in it so we're, we're gonna be good to go all right so again you click on that edit button and um, you basically go this page is gonna pop up now the first thing you want to edit is this the ad set itself and this is where you uh, choose the audience now let's change the ad set name to uh, look alike uh, five dollar a day is fine let's we click on this and let's add the one percent okay this is the lookalike audience let's actually filter it like that there you go so look like us one percent golf data golf video data this is the one we're going to choose and let's delete this okay and then uh, uh next thing you want to do is you want to do the age because uh, if you remember in the last video i didn't do the age but this one i'm doing it because i want to make sure i'm filtering this lookalike audience because this lookalike audience is not uh, exactly people uh, we, we're, we don't we kind of don't know them they're they're not engaged with our channel so the goal of this ad is to get them engaged with our channel okay so next one is um let's choose men if you remember again my main audience in this campaign is men are men so we want to make sure we do that and that the rest should be good all right so let's click on save and continue and next thing you want to edit is the ad itself so you're going to click on this and you click on edit you can uh, choose the you can change the name i usually don't touch it but you can touch it you can change it if you want let's change it to um something i don't know look like ad all right so next thing you want to do is you're going to change this to an image this is really important because i already have this video here right uh the video uh, people are going to see this video so if you I have if i have the video in uh, front up front on the ad people are not going to I mean there's no point for them to click on this ad to see this video in the back end right so it's really important to choose uh, the right image now let's go and let me actually go and choose the um, change it to the image and you're going to select the image let's select this there you go that, that looks perfect um the text is good it's pretty much same discover the amazing view golf swing correction let's get that here
Alright. Yeah, I'm just playing with this to see which one looks better. Alright, so that looks good. Uh, learn more. And next thing you want to change is the URL, obviously, because you don't want to send them to the old landing page. We, we want to send them to the engagement landing page, right? So let's do that. That looks good. And everything else should be fine. So you click on save and continue. And you click on place order. And done. All right, let's wait for it to um, kind of go through. Perfect. All right, so that said, pretty much our campaigns are running. Everything is working. The cycle is working and everything is in place. Now, all you need to do is just sit back, watch it and just optimize if you need to. Now, I'm going to talk about optimization in updates. So you really don't have to do much, but I'm going to talk about it and tell you if there if sometimes you might need to make some changes on optimizations, not usually, but once in a while and I'm gonna talk about it in updates alright so let me know if you have any questions make sure to apply everything that I just showed you and move forward with me again that's what I said before if you remember when I started do everything with me so you're gonna do it so you're gonna actually do it learn it by doing it alright so let me know if you have any questions and I'll see you in next videos and updates have a great day